Um, I'm sat in my car on a car park because I've got a migraine. <laughs> um, yeah, I've got a migraine and I've had it since about 6.30. It started to ease off, as I said in previous clips, and then um, it got worse. After I filmed my last clip, I literally got changed, went downstairs, took two paracetamol, and then had um, a few sips of water, then left the house, went to the shop, and picked up a few things, forgot painkillers, but I needed to go to another shop to get um, the water I wanted. So I came to another shop, picked up some Nurofen and paracetamol. Um, normally when I take pain relief, I literally take two Nurofen and two paracetamol and that normally does the job for most kinds of pain, like even the worst kinds that you can imagine. But that's what I took earlier, my first lot of painkillers, about half past six. But that was my last two Nurofen. And then, like I said, I went downstairs and took two paracetamol. They were my last two. And I got them out of my bag because I always carry pain relief in my bag just in case. So I had to get paracetamol. And I rarely ever buy paracetamol these days. And I had to get Nurofen as well. And I'm just sat here hoping it'll ease. I know I took the paracetamol an hour ago. But... I've done this before where I've took two paracetamol, gone to the shop and bought my Nurofen and took it like an hour later and it's had the same effect as in taking them together. I did try and get a Diet Coke but they didn't have any and actually when I was in this shop earlier, because I've been to this shop twice today, um, they didn't have Diet Coke earlier and the shelves haven't actually been restocked in the cold drink section which I think is a bit crap because I was here at 3 o'clock and now it's just about to turn 11pm so it's a bit rubbish that they haven't restocked them and I almost bought a can of Diet Coke but it just doesn't taste as good as in a bottle but I did want the Diet Coke because I need a bit of energy because I have stuff I need to do before I can go to bed so I'm going to hope these tablets work because I'm super nauseous as well and I've got chest pain right in the middle so I doubt it's a heart attack and I'm not ringing 111 because last time I did I ended up in hospital for four days and that's why they sent them on the blue light because one of my symptoms was chest pain and then obviously I had sepsis and all that but we already know all that because yeah I don't know if that video is actually up yet because I'm holding back on those videos because I want other content up. I don't want to put, I think it's four videos or maybe five videos up one after another all about what happened the second time I ended up in hospital. So I'm trying to film content but I don't particularly want to be on camera and I don't know like I'm in a place in my head that isn't very good and different to the places I've been before. So. Yeah, and as I said, I'm just trying to get to the 1st of July with this channel. Then I'll see what's going on and how I'm feeling, but I don't know. Like, it'll be sad to, like, not film, but I feel like I need to not film for a while. And I don't know, like, I feel like I'm going to film certain things, but I'm not going to film my everyday life, or film clips here and there and put weekly vlogs up I don't know like no promises no nothing really um if I can get to the first of July I'll be happy I mean as I said in other videos and I don't know if they're up yet but I presume they are my ultimate goal would have got be to get to a full year of everyday uploads but it just takes a lot out of me and I don't really have much left to say anymore like there were times I had a lot to say and it was just so, because I was so frustrated with the way I was being treated and things that were going on, but I no longer feel frustrated. And I think it's because I finally got to get things off my chest and say them and now they're said. I don't have anything to be frustrated about. 
so I don't know like my doctor said to me um I need to just concentrate on getting better and that's really it really she wants me to get better I mean I'm not saying I don't want to get better because of course I don't want to feel the way that I feel like it, it's not a nice feeling feeling this way 